first test for electromagnetic catapult system marks an important step in testing phase for the Chinese supercarrier. The newest Chinese aircraft carrier has started with dead load launch testing for her electromagnetic catapult system, as was confirmed by footage circulating on Chinese and Western social media. On November 26, Chinese military enthusiasts shared footage first on Chinese social media platform Weibo and subsequently also on X, formerly Twitter, recorded from an airplane overflying the extensive shipyard facilities where CNS-18 Fujian, also known as the Type 003 aircraft carrier, is currently berthed. Since the Pudong Shanghai International Airport is located very closely to Chongqing Island, the location of builder Jiangmen and other shipyards, related imagery taken from passenger planes has become a common source to follow the progress of several major PLAN programs. The video footage shows launch and subsequent drop of a test vehicle from one of the two forward catapult positions on the new aircraft carrier, into the water of the basin in front of Fujian. A large barge used to move hull components had previously relocated from its mooring position also in front of Fujian, ostensibly to make way for this part the testing regime. Similar efforts, termed dead load, testing, are common for all catapult-equipped aircraft carriers, including after major overhauls, such as most recently on French Navy carrier Charles de Gaulle in Toulon. Overflight and satellite imagery shared on social media on November 19 and over the following days had previously shown Fujian moving away from her berth. The development prompted expectations over a sea trial, although this seemed unlikely at the time, given no preparations to crew and equip the carrier for such a step were visible on the Fujian over the preceding weeks. In fact at least some construction and integration work appears to still be ongoing notably around the island. Given the new imagery now, the event was likely related to the Chinese aircraft carrier having started catapult testing. This notion is supported also by spotting of several large orange objects likely to represent the dead load test vehicles. Over the next few days the carrier then returned to her normal berth location. Fujian moving away a short distance and then returning to the mooring position may have been required in the context of testing her starboard third catapult launch position on the angled flight deck although this remains speculative.